Hey, there. Today, I am going to show you how to use Vencord and plugins. If you've ever wanted to add cool modifications to your Discord client without breaking any rules, you're in the right place. So, let's dive into it. First things first, we need to download and install Vencord. You can do this from the official Vencord website. So, first. Open your favorite browser. Once it is opened, click on the search bar. Then search for Vencord. Now, take your time to explore the website, you'll find plenty of information about Vencord and its features. Then click on the first official link. Once this is opened, select your device. Then click on Download Vencord Installer. Once you've downloaded the file, click on it to open it. It's time to patch your Discord client. Make sure you know where your Discord is installed, especially if it's in a custom location. When you're ready, click Install. This might take a few moments, so sit back and relax. Make sure that Discord is closed. Once the installation is complete, go ahead and open Discord. Now, let's head over to the user settings. Take your time, there's no rush. You'll notice a new section called a Vencord. This means the installation was successful. And now you're ready to explore the world of Vencord plugins. Now that Vencord is installed, let's dive into some of the popular plugins that make it so special. Then click on Plugins section. These plugins are safe to use and won't get you banned. Get to the search bar. Let's start with the fake Nitro plugin. Remember, this plugin doesn't actually give you Nitro, but it does let you use some cool features like external emojis, animated emojis, and stickers. These are sent as links, so your friends without Nitro can still see them. Next, let's look at the Demember Count plugin. Search for it in the search bar. This handy tool shows you the total and online members in a server right at the top of the member list. If you're curious about how active a server is, this plugin is perfect. Another great plugin is Better Folder combined with a plain folder icon. Search for this plugin in the search bar. With a Better Folder, your servers will display to the right, rather than popping up below. The plain folder icon plugin simplifies your folder icons, removing the little server icons inside. This combination gives your Discord a cleaner, more organized look. Let's move on to a plugin that adds a dynamic touch to your Discord, the Always Animate plugin. Search for Always Animate. This plugin automatically animates all images that can be animated, including server icons and members with animated avatars. It brings your Discord client to life. Next, the a preview message a plugin allows you to see how your message will appear in a channel before you send it. Search for this in the search bar. This is especially useful if you want to make sure your message looks just right before hitting send. One of the more discreet plugins is Silent Typing. You can easily search for it in the search bar. This plugin hides the typing alert that usually appears when you're composing a message. Enable it, and your friends won't know when you're typing. Another incredibly useful plugin is a pin DM. Search for it in the search bar. Discord doesn't natively support this, but with Vencord, you can pin any direct message to the top of your list, making it easily accessible. There are even more plugins to explore, such as Emoji Cloner, which lets you quickly copy any emoji to your server. Another useful plugin is Image Zoom. You can search this in the search bar. This allows you to zoom into images directly within Discord without needing to open them in a browser. It's perfect for viewing screenshots with text or code. If you communicate with people who speak different languages, the to translate a plugin is a must-have. You can install it from the plugins section. 
It uses Google Translate to translate any message right within Discord, so you don't have to copy and paste text into a separate translator. Finally, let's talk about themes. With Vencord, you can change your Discord client theme without needing Nitro. Browse through the official website or GitHub to find a theme you like. Once you've downloaded it, just copy it to the themes folder in Vencord. After enabling the theme, you'll see your Discord client take on a whole new look. It's a great way to personalize your experience. And that's how you use Vencord and plugins. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like this video and don't forget to subscribe for more in-depth tutorials. See you next time.